Okay, so you need backup power. But when you start looking, you're hit with this big choice. Do you go with the raw brute force of a traditional generator or the quiet, high-tech precision of a modern inverter? It's a tough call. So we're going to break them both down piece by piece to help you figure out which one is the perfect fit for you. Just imagine this for a second. You're chilling at home, maybe watching a movie, and then bam, everything goes dark. The power's out. It gets real quiet real fast. And in that silence, you have to ask yourself, what's my plan right now? You know, these days, a power outage is so much more than just an inconvenience. I mean, we're talking about a fridge full of food going bad, which is hundreds of dollars down the drain. We're talking about vital medications that need to stay cold. Your phone dies, your internet's out, and suddenly you're cut off. For a lot of us, it means you can't work from home. Or even worse, it could disrupt critical medical equipment. A generator isn't really a luxury anymore. It's all about safety, security, and just, you know, peace of mind. All right, so first up, let's talk about our first contender. This is the one you've definitely seen around, probably on a construction site, or maybe you've heard it rumbling away during a storm. This is the traditional generator. Think of this thing as the heavy lifter, the absolute powerhouse of the generator world. Its design is super straightforward. An engine turns an alternator, and you get a whole lot of electricity. It's built for one main purpose, to deliver the maximum amount of power you need. And honestly, it does that job extremely well. So why are these machines still so incredibly popular? Well, it really boils down to raw, unfiltered power. We are talking enough juice to run your entire house. The fridge, the freezer, the air conditioner, all of it. They're also usually a lot easier on the wallet up front, and because they're mechanically simple, they're often easier to maintain. These things are true workhorses, built to take a beating and keep on going. But what if you don't need to power a fortress? What if your biggest concerns are being quiet and making sure your expensive electronics are safe? Well, that is exactly where our new challenger comes in. This is the inverter generator, and it's basically the result of modern engineering designed for our tech-filled lives. Now, this isn't just a smaller version of the other guy. It's a totally different beast. The real magic here is how it creates what we call clean power. The machine actually produces AC power, converts it to DC, and then inverts it back to a super stable, pure AC signal. It's like a high-tech filter for your electricity, giving you the same kind of perfect power that comes out of your wall outlets. And that stability is absolutely crucial for protecting your laptop, your TV, your phone, all that sensitive stuff. The perks here are all about being smart and efficient. First off, the quiet operation is a total game changer, especially for camping or if you have neighbors close by. The engine is also smart. It adjusts its speed based on how much power you're actually using, which can save you a ton on fuel, sometimes up to 40% more efficient. And here's a really cool trick. They're not just portable. You can often link two of them together to literally double your power. It's all about flexibility. So. We've got the powerful workhorse on one side and the smart modern solution on the other. Two very different ways to get the job done. Now let's put them side by side and see how they really stack up. Okay, let's start with maybe the single biggest difference, the noise. Picture a lawnmower running right outside your window. That's pretty much a traditional generator. Now imagine just having a normal conversation with someone. That's an inverter. I mean, for anyone who's ever gone camping or has neighbors, that difference right there is absolutely everything. And this chart is where the trade-offs get really, really clear. With a traditional generator, yeah, you get way more power for a lower upfront cost, but you're giving up clean power, you're giving up fuel efficiency, and they're a pain to move around. Inverters, on the other hand, give you that perfect, clean power, amazing efficiency, and a super lightweight design, but you're definitely gonna pay more for that technology. This really gets to the core of it. Neither one is flat out better. They're just built for completely different jobs. Okay, so with all of that info on the table, the final choice really just comes down to you. It's all about matching the machine's strengths to what your life actually looks like. So let's make this super simple. The traditional generator is a no-brainer if your main goal is to power your whole house during a blackout or to run really heavy-duty stuff like a well pump or your central air. If getting the absolute most wattage for your dollar is your number one priority and you're not too worried about a bit of noise, then the workhorse is without a doubt the way to go. Now, on the flip side, an inverter is the right move if you're thinking about camping trips, tailgating, or you just don't want to be that neighbor during a power outage. If you absolutely have to power your laptop, smartphone, or other delicate gadgets without frying them, 
And if you really value fuel efficiency and being able to just pick it up and go, then this modern smart solution is tailor-made for you. And that really brings us to the final thought here. In the world we live in today, having a plan for when the power goes out isn't really optional anymore. So the only real question you have to answer is, which of these tools is the right one for the job you need it to do? Whether it's the raw muscle of the workhorse or the quiet intelligence of the smart solution, making that right choice means you'll never be left in the dark again.